President Obama making history in Hiroshima this morning, becoming the first sitting American president to travel there since the U.S. dropped an atomic bomb in 1945, near the end of World War II. ABC's Jim Avila is in Japan with the latest. Good morning, Jim. Robin, this morning, President Obama walked the solemn spot where the United States dropped the first atomic bomb in war. It was a controversial visit that American presidents have been avoiding for some 70 years. As promised, he did not apologize for Harry Truman's decision to end the war with a nuclear explosion that killed 160,000 people. Instead, with North Korea obviously on his mind and with Japanese Prime Minister Abe at his side, laying a condolence wreath and pleading for world leaders to put an end to not just nuclear weapons, but to war itself. We must change our mindset about war itself to prevent conflict through diplomacy. A powerful moment in history, an American president calling for the end of the nuclear era that the United States began some 70 years ago. Robin? That was quite a moment, Jim, with the president in Japan. Okay, it certainly was.